More than a decade. Over a decade. By quite a large amount. <laughs> but he's seen his fair share of sheiks. Yeah, so we'll see what's gonna happen if you can master that matchup though. And right now, I mean, oh. seems to get the kind of the control, but uh, you never know with Leffen also what can happen. But once again, keeping the control is what Mackenzie loves to do. Mm. Yeah, so far so good. D doing like, a, he, he's been doing a good job of like, you know, holding the space. Threatening with the forward airs. Oh, yeah. Okay. One thing to note though, if there is one matchup where France is weak at, it's chic. We have no chic. But nice, really nice fair and force match. But yeah, we have no mm. chic in France, no really good, good chic. We had N now, but for a very long time we had no chic. So I don't know how prepared Mackenzie is mm. uh, in that regards. Yeah. But it's also it's an it's a new it's a new European connection now. Perhaps That's perhaps true. he's been training with some of the, the European greats, maybe arms have oh. been in the that, games. That's very true, that's completely true. Oh, okay. For now, can she's as well? I, I've been seeing Makenshi fiending games. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, he wants he wants to play. She wants to play a lot. I remember like he, he stopped for a while, okay, he took a break, and then he came back to a tournament and he got destroyed by Leffen in that tournament. And he told me, now my main goal is to destroy Leffen. Oh. Never happened until then. It was years ago. Maybe he switched his objective, uh his objective, his goal since mm -hmm. then. But that aside. It definitely brings up some, uh, some maybe some fresh flesh still hitting up in his heart. Mm. I can I can see it from what I've seen of Mackenzie. He's definitely a, a committed person. He is. I think yeah. I think he'd stick to that goal, and he's got his chance to. Okay, next movement. The thing is, like, actually, that that game is pretty pretty close for now. Mm. Like, let's be honest. Like, yeah. Leffen struggled to find an opening. Yeah. We, Mackenzie needs to play, like, safe, though. I don't want to see him overshoot and... Cause, like, like, right now, as you as you're saying, it's really close, 108%, but... Moth right is kicking in. Nice. Stop the bleeding. Yeah. Okay, oh, great, great grab. Really yeah. great grab. Okay, it did not stall with the RB. Catching uh, Leffen by surprise there. Wait, don't tell. Nice DI, but he's already ready for that. And yep. the fair. Oh, no impact landed on the platform. Mess him up. Oh, that's an interesting. Yeah. That's interesting to stand that close to the ledge. <gasps> I think I think Martin does struggle there. That was very quick. Yeah, that's that that so strong. But that's that's actually very true. I feel like yeah, 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 um, keeping keeping the it's good to be on the ledge with Marv on a, a lot of matchup, but not against mm. Sheik. You got the down smash. Any tilts can push you off stage and maybe just yep. lead to a fair. Uh, it's tough. It's really tough, and yep. I do agree with you. But the uh, way, and I think he was crouching by the ledge just to like cover any aerial that Marth does to get back up. Yeah, crouch cancel, shove him off stage again. Mm. Yeah, makes yeah, sense. Tough. Tough, tough moments in any case, but I feel like also once again, the thing that Mackenzie liked the most is his punish game, and that aside, Lefen is amazing at it, and I feel that's that was one of the most uh, main difference in the previous game, because like Lefen was ready to, as we said, just let trap the Mackenzie and just keep him on the corner and just get the kill afterwards, get amazing punish, but Mackenzie let Lefen doing his thing a lot of the time and just let him uh, survive for maybe yes. too long. Yeah. Okay. Nice Very when, uh, when she can get she can get center. He did a good job to get away from it. Mm -hmm. Okay, nice use for the recovery. What a smash GI! <laughs> Where's he going? <laughs> what was he made up? Great covering by Lefendo. Yeah, that's the thing. As as amazing everything Rakenshi was doing. Equally amazing for Leffen just to be ready to cover it. Yeah. Okay. That's the thing in Super Smash Brothers Melee, usually. You cover something, but you need to be ready for the next step, because you all know yes. your opponent will do something afterwards. You need to be one step ahead. Yeah. Which is hard, because Melee is so quick, and so much can change in an instant. 
but you have to you have to be thinking that way. Yeah. I mean, you need to aim at the check checkmate situation every single time. Like, uh, yeah. If there's another step where your opponent can just flee away, cover that also. Or oh, like in G moment, unfortunately, Ooh. the last fair was a sore spot. Maybe he didn't want to. I don't know. Mm. But once again, you're in the corner, and as we said, that's the moment where it's tough. Yeah. It's really tough. That's really tough. That's the thing. Like you make one tiny mistake. So much of Mackenzie's combo was working really well, and then he just overextended just a little bit. And suddenly, left him was on his case. Oh, yeah. Okay, great wall of uh, back air from, uh, from Leffen right now. For a throw, taking the edge. Up B, Ooh, eating him. Uh, up B, uh, side B wanted to say sorry. Mm -hmm. But that aside, Leffen is back on track. Nice slip off from uh, Mackenzie. Oh! oh. <laughs> oh. Went so down. That's brilliant. That, that was brilliant. It's a hard call out, which is all the more impressive on players of this caliber. I agree. But that the fact that he definitely recognized the fact that Leffen was always making some low recovery because it's tough for Marv to cover it. It just went for it, and for an hard read, go with the up B. Mm -hmm. That's and it's not hard for Sheik to punish a moth trying to do that. <laughs> That's true. So, very good call out. Okay, good wait, forcing the air dodge. Yeah, not second time in a row, and I will just like try to do and take the high recovery for a smash. Unfortunately, dying up will allow Leffen to find the fair afterwards, but still managed to get back on the stage, finding the nair, finding the forward smash. Last talk. These. This is risky, but he's keeping it together. Oh. Yeah. yeah Le Leffen it's... knew that the, the main thing he risked was the down air, so he definitely like moved around the down air. It was like, nah, nah, mate, nah, nah. No down air, no down air. <laughs> he was definitely ready for it. That was an interesting recovery by, uh, by, uh, by uh, Leffen. But the other thing interesting, it's that... Mackenzie might have found a solution while playing Sheik again uh, on the edge. Yes, he was doing like he was finding, he was giving out new options, and actually coming up with a counter proved to be quite effective. Mm -hmm. But that could have been arguably Leffen pulling the trigger a bit too early, because one of the benefits of him being able to crouch by the ledge is that it forces if Marth doesn't move, then he can just take the hit attack. That's true. But and then if he waited out the. Uh, the counter that would have worked too. Okay, so now we are on final destination, the Mar stage. But against Sheik, it's still always, as as you know, uh, can be difficult because she got her grab, for instance, and also a great work of juggle, as we are seeing right now. Already 78% dealt, no kill just yet. Went for it, crouch can crouch can't even yeah. fair. But what a tech by Mackenzie Ooh. also taking the lead afterwards. Rolls, but got him to safety. Nice. Okay. Okay, just the need those, and that would be enough. You have no more double jump, no more side B or anything. Just push you, just ra just what we needed to take the stocks. <laughs> and the way he's using these the crash cancels is very frightening for Marth. Mm. Okay. Done throw. Hey. Oh! Ooh. That hurt! Oh, yeah, that landed like really awful. <laughs> okay, can make and she and all that edge guard. I did not. I don't know why he high jump. That was a bit weird. The nice side beat down yeah. here, though. A bit weird, but we take those. Yeah, Leffen just. It just. I uh, just. Troll. Mm. Nice up tilt, though. Alright. And I definitely agree, like, it's tough, it's really tough for Mackenzie to just, like, uh, take back the, 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 the control of the, of the stage of the match. But even then, fighting that forward smash cheaper will allow him to take that stock and maybe <laughs> even it up. Maybe. That is exactly what he wants to see. Uh-huh. I don't feel that Mackenzie's a... And perhaps it's due to um, left and spacing, I wouldn't put it past him, but... He, he's not been hitting, like, he, 
to deal with the crouch cancel that Leffen's putting out, you want to get him with the tipper of the fair itself. So it pushes away a little bit, does a bit more hit stun, gives Moth a chance to dash back. But he's not been getting them, so Leffen's just been able to attack him straight on. Yeah, or he's facing just outside of the range and is able to punish. So, good job. Leffen is so good at knowing when your open, the opponent is going to retreat, man. He just went to the edge, he knew um, uh, Makichi was about to retreat. He just ledge dash, dash in, find the grab. But even if he pulled out 67%, that won't be enough to take the kill on Makichi. On the other hand, Makichi did. Still a mountain though. Got it again. Okay, great boar shield roll. Okay. Okay. Oh, read, he read that double jump, but he just misplayed the fair, I think. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Leffen just went straight for it, like, no yeah. time to lose. <laughs> <laughs> but unfortunately for Mackenzie, he did too with his F smash. Just immediately let it rip. Tempting. Like, you could feel it. If Leffen just tacks in place and this F smash hit him, then I take the game. Yeah, it just went for it. It just oh, went for dude. it. Yeah. Once again, Lefen is do is doing what Lefen does the best, 3 owing his opponent. He is. He is. Which does make me quite excited to watch him play Kinzo. Uh, that's very true, actually. That's very true. I mean, the Lefen in loser side is really exciting because now any single match can be Lefen out of the tournament and not at the first place. So for sure, I'm really excited to see Lefen uh, play to against any of the players in the, in the rest of the very player. realistic that this... Like, most of the time when Lefen enters a tournament... Probably some of you watching think, ah, well, I wonder who'll get second. <laughs> but in this case, it's a very real possibility. Now, is will Leffen win the tournament or not? Because yeah. like, there's still that question, can he make the comeback from the losers? Exactly. Nobody's sure now. Yeah. Beforehand, it was almost, almost a given that he'd be winning the tournament. But now yeah. it's like, actually, I don't even know if it's in his favor. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. Beating Frenzy twice? Oh, God. Imagine. Or oh, Pittsburgh, of course, you know. <laughs> 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 Alright, in any case, before we jump